We think there's a lot of things that you'll see today that'll help you understand how the Windows Phone is different. But I'd focus on two key themes, always delightful and wonderfully mine. We'll have nine phones available with, when the Windows Phone ships here in the United States in November. Nine different phones. There's a range of phones here from LG, from Samsung, from HTC, and from Dell. What I'm going to do is show you a demo. And what you'll see up on the screen there is exactly what I do with my finger here. So you're seeing a projection of this phone. And our idea of smart design actually starts right there on the lock screen, where you'll notice down on the bottom of the lock screen, we put up your next calendar appointment. So if you just want to have a quick glance at where you're supposed to go next, you pull your phone out, you turn it on, you can see your next appointment, and you're, you're off and good to go. Now, when I pan this up to unlock it, you see the Windows Phone start experience. Uh, down on the bottom there in hardware, you'll see we have three hardware buttons. These are consistent on all the phones. There's a back button, really simple, take you back to where you were, a start button that gets you to this experience, and a search button. More on that later. And as I pan down, you'll see these live tiles are lighting up with information about all my experiences. It's telling me I have two unread mail messages. It's telling me I have an unread text message. That was my uh, last Facebook post backstage ready to rock. It's showing up on my phone and on all my friends' phones. You see my Xbox Live avatar down there. The Pictures Hub has automatically customized with pictures of my twins. Uh, the Music and Videos Hub shows me what I've last been playing. And one of the key features for making the phone really wonderfully yours, really deeply personal, is being able to put the people that you care about right up there on your start experience in a live tile.